Hello, Internet friends. This is Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions bringing you today's Tech Tip Tuesday. It's Tuesday, the 19th of December. Next week is Christmas. So I'm wearing my gaudy, well, it's not mine. I'm borrowing it. Gaudy, ugly Christmas sweater. Merry Christmas to you all. Uh, I hope this season is joyous and blessed for you and your families. Uh, today's tip is about about terrain, and I'm, I've had some uh, inquiries about terrain. I'm going to start off with a very simple one. Uh, I don't know where you're at in the uh, form of terrain and, and all it takes there, uh, so I thought I'd share this one with you. I'm working on a barn that uh, has a grade, I'll draw it, in the front we're down here, and in the rear it kind of slopes up, I'm exaggerating, somewhere in here. Um, so I'm going to turn this this way so we can kind of get a better view of that if you will. I'm going to make it flat here and then I'm going to slope up in, in a more even slope than this and then flat across here. Okay so let's go to the plan view and I'm going to terrain, create terrain perimeter. Now, first off, I'm going to open this terrain box and I'm going to uncheck automatic and make this zero. And that's fine. We'll leave that at zero. Everything else is fine with me. We'll leave it just like that. What we're going to need to do now, though, is terrain elevation data and there's a couple of different ways that you can set the elevation data on a terrain perimeter. For this one, I'll show you two options. Elevation line. I'm going to draw a line across here, down at this end. And we're going to move that right up against the building. And a line at this end. All right. We're going to open up the first line down by down at the bottom of the screen, leave that at elevation zero, that's fine. Open up this one and I'm going to give it an elevation of 30 for the moment. Now we've got two points um, in our, in our uh, terrain model and since it's only two, it's going to make, we'll draw it, it's just going to make a straight line like this with one point here, that's my 30, and this point is my 0. The rest of it's just going to interpolate between and beyond, you know, what's going on there. That's not what we want, but that's what it's going to do for the moment. And let's switch to uh, elevation view. And you can see how it continues sloping down from this garage door in the front and it continues sloping up in the rear. Now if I were to keep, if I were to copy my elevation line down here, and this is still at zero, and copy this one back here and move it toward the rear, this is at 30. Let me draw what it would do. So we've got our, whoops, that's not what I wanted. We've got our line here at 30 and our line here at 0. We've got another line at 0 and another line at 30. This is going, because these are just lines, this is going to interpolate it kind of like this and like this because it takes into account this side as well as this side of our lines, right? So what I want is I want it to come like this and come flat across the top and the bottom, not make this hump, if you will. So let's take a look at the at the uh, camera view and, and you'll see how, what I'm talking about. I exaggerated it, but you can see how this gets lower and this gets 
higher. This comes up and keeps on going down then. So I'm going to actually delete these elevation lines and I'm going to make what's called an elevation region. Everything within this elevation region is flat and then I'm going to make this elevation region as well. So this one I want at 0 and the top one up here I want at 30 and now I'm going to do my terrain build terrain view and let's take a camera. Now You see this is flat, we start sloping up, and this is flat up here at the top. That is the very most basics of terrain. Um, again, I don't know quite where you're at with your level of terrain, so I wanted to start with the basics. As I said, upcoming in the future, I'll get into a more um, detailed and uh, contoured terrain. Uh, I'm working on that uh, right now and hopefully in the next uh, few weeks we'll have that uh, up for you. It, if this has been helpful for you I would appreciate a thumbs up. Let me know where you're at with, um, with uh, your level of terrains and comfortability with that or maybe um, a, specific, a specific thing that you're getting stuck on and can't quite figure out what to do with that. Let me know in the comments below. As always, subscribe. Uh, I will be releasing these videos each week, and that way you'll be getting those uh, notices and, and uh, follow along as we release this. Hey, again, have a Merry Christmas. Uh, have a great week. We'll talk to you soon.